In a previous video, we learned on how to connect QEMU using PLC. This time, we're going to learn on how to connect QEMU using Remote Viewer with SPICE. So let's get started. For this demo, we'll be using SPICE as our solution for remote access to virtual machine in a seamless way so you can play videos, record audio, share USB, and share folders without any complication. To learn more about SPICE, just visit the website at www.spice-space.org. Alright, without any further ado, let's begin the installation. To start with, let us update our Linux distro. Type sudo apt update. Enter password. Once done, let us install now our spice. Type sudo apt hyphen y install spice v p agent and hit enter. Next, once done, we need to shut down our guest OS to take effect the settings. So let's start. Before we start, let us examine first our code line. On the first line here, this is the original code, which you can be found at the bottom of this description below. Added to that, at this line as our communication to SPICE with a port of 5930. All right? So let's begin. In this section, we're going to create a batch file to execute our QEMU. And to do that, Make sure you are in the directory of your root. Then from here, press Shift, then right-click on your mouse. Select Open PowerShell window here. Then from here, let's type Notepad and the name of the file. For that file, I'm going to call that as start point but. To start with, let us type the following at echo op start exit. Under or next to start, space, paste the code line, make sure everything is in single line, for more details just copy on the description below, just paste it here, then save, once done, click close, next, select the start, Right-click, click, open, and there you go. At this point here, there's nothing else you can see from this section here. Now, for us to access the system, we need to download the remote viewer. So let's start. Next, to download our remote viewer, we need to head back to our SPICE website and head over to the download section. From here, let us select Windows Installer. 
then select Beard Manager Download Page. Then from here, select, from this section here, there's a section for, for 32 and 64. So for us, let us download the 64 version. Just click from this section here. Just continue with the downloads. Then later, we need to install that locally. So that's it guys. Before we proceed with the remote viewer, let us examine first of our remote protocol. From here, we need to specify the spice and with the host name, which is the local host and the port that we assigned a while ago. All right, so what's done, let us proceed now with remote viewer. Before we begin, make sure your QEMU is actively running. Next, head over to your start menu and look for remote viewer. On the connection address, paste the, this line, then click connect. And there you go. Let's log in. All right, that's it, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video and please hit the like button and subscribe for any video just like this. Cheers.